Um, hi guys. Um, I wrote a song today. If you, no one probably knows this, but I write songs for myself, and I don't share with other people. But today, this song. You know everyone's like been writing about oh breakups and love songs and everything else and almost like everything's about. I wrote something different. I even have a title for it. A, it's peace, random, awesome, amazing. No one has ever heard song. Yeah. Well, I'm not gonna sing it because I'm a very bad singer, but I will read it to you. Random things can happen, but it doesn't mean that they have to be bad. People rule the world, and people do bad stuff, like go to war. And what I mean by like go to war, as in mean like China, like, like I don't mean like people going to war to fight for us and our freedom. That's not what I mean. I don't want to offend anybody about that. It. What I'm trying to say is that, like, how we bombed Japan and everything, like, a long time ago. Like, we shouldn't have to go to war like that. Like, the, like the president of China, um, um, calling war against us. Um, calling war against us and sending a hundred people over here and trying to kill us. That's what I mean by, like, go to war. And kill innocent creatures. People cheat and kill and lie and fight. All for different reasons. But we shouldn't have to. We shouldn't do these things. People live on the streets while others live in big mansions. With everything that they wanted. Our world shouldn't be like this. But it is. It's pretty sad but. When I'm ready I'll sing it. But. Um, by the way, this is my journal. Um, my sister got it for me, actually. My journal. No one is allowed to read it. Because it has things in here that no one should read. It has my story that I wrote. It's my pumpkin story, which is student language. It's a perspective of a pumpkin, which looks nice. It has who I like in it. It has who other people like in it. It has random math equations it has um my drawings it has quotes that one day when I become famous in my imagination um like you know how they put like a slant and then like someone's name yeah I, I have those I have my songs I have my duct tape yeah I duct tape things a lot I have like contracts with myself, like I'll never be mean to people, I'll always stop people from being bullied and all like that. And then I'll send my name. More songs and more drones. There is actually a handprint in here. This is exclusive. Um The hand put in here. It says Chloe Emily Lind, um, eleven seven fourteen, one thirty three p.m. in Golo Middle School. I put dates on stuff. Like if I write something, I put a date on it. If I draw something, I'll put a date on it. And like, what am I doing? What am I watching? If I do a quote, I'll put the date. I wrote a letter to myself, and I still have it actually. And it says the date and everything. It's been like two years. I found something the other day I drew and everything and because we my mom was cleaning cleaning out like this huge box of papers and it says July I don't know like twenty seventh, two thousand thirteen. I'm like, yeah, this is why I put think um put dates on things because like when I pick it up and find it, I'm like, Oh yeah, I know what this is and it brings back the memory of when I did it. Pretty cool. And when I write the description of what I'm doing and what I'm watching, it actually brings back a whole lot of the memory. And I have kind of a good memory. If you tell me your birthday, there is a good possible chance, like a 75% chance I will remember it. And then there's a 25% where I 
I won't remember it. But, I'm weird. People will say that a lot. Because I, I act goofy. And see, look at this drawing I do. It's really weird. Um, uh, I want to give a shout out to my friend, Valerie. She actually has a YouTube she actually has a YouTube uh, channel. I want you guys to go watch it, okay? Her name is Valerie Doan. If you go to her channel, she has like two videos, and it's amazing, okay? She's my friend Val. I um, also want to give a shout out to my friend Ethan. He's been going through a tough time. And it's kind of sad, because, I mean, he, like, was getting bullied by Val's boyfriend. And then, like, Val broke up with him a couple days later, and then he's still bullying him. Yeah. It's really sad. He needs, he needs to be, um, what do you call it? He needs help. So, I guess that's it. I had a really good day. Oh, and I'm reading the second book of If I Stay. It's where she went. Weird thing is, I'm not trying to ruin it for anybody, but it's Adam's perspective. It's after she was from the hospital. It's really weird. So, bye! Peace out!